Sfarovic has in the midfield. The game. Bad football. Out of bounds, it looks like it's going to be Medford ball. And it's controlled by Belmont. Kicked back out towards the midfield and out of bounds again. Belmont ball. I think we're looking for a fast game today. What do you mean by that? Like a fast, like a fast, fast pace. pace. Yeah, like a fast pace game. A little bit of a scuffle there. Yeah. Looking at Ooh, good ball. Someone's got to get there. Cook wants it. Good and deflected, it's going to be Cook. a corner for Wakefield. Well, it's not Wakefield. No, it's Medford. Medford, Medfield, Medford. <laughs> corner for Medford. Yeah. This game. We've got Thomas in goal he's an outstanding goalkeeper and it'll be out of bounds we and a goal kick 10, for Belmont Sochel Kenkre coming in right now yeah one of our captains for Belmont <laughs> Niko Stefanovic passes it back back to Nikola a little bit of Daniel going for it right to Bedford and out of bounds again. Belmont ball. Yeah, that's what I thought. I thought that was the fourth set. Sorry, and just being just being updated on the Belmont volleyball game. Satchel Kenker is now in the game. Andrew passes to Cook. Down Sochel. the field. Satchel going down the field. Pass one. Tries to get a through ball to Patrick ball. Tang and it is not completed. Belmont ball. We're looking at a throw in for Alex Cook. For the throw in. To Daniel. Maybe to Sachel. Down the line, and it'll be a goal kick. That's, yeah, yeah, goal kick. For Medford. Yes. Medford. Belmont in a little bit of a press here. Trying to control the ball. And they do. Giving it to Sochel. He's looking to score. He's looking to score. Trying to get a shot off. To Finds Cook. Cook. Oh. Cuts down Ooh. line. Oh, that's Ooh. gotta be a foul. It's gotta be a penalty. Yep. There we go. That's a good play. Looks like Sochel's gonna take that kick. This is Sochel's bread and butter. Hopefully he can get one. To the back of the net. Good butter. That's good. Yeah, that's, that's good. good. <clears throat> Sachel is a left footed kicker, so this favors him. A little unorthodox. So hopefully, we'll, we'll see what he's got. We'll see what he's got. Justin, the ball there. Back it up. Four. Got to make five, sure it's like 10 feet steps, from the line, you seven. know? Seven. Set it up. Or maybe he'll cross it, you don't know. Oof, good shot, Ooh. good shot. Good, good take, try. good take, good take. Good try. We like that. Yep. <coughs> Want as many shots Momentum on goal as right possible. There. And a long ball to the striker. I really think someone should be back there. We got a... And the cross we know is it's there, but kicked out by Nikola Stefanovic. Goal kick right there. Trying to control the ball, and it's still in the air. Patrick Tang kicks it to the midfield. Trying to just clear it out. Where Nikola ball again. Where Number Nikola two, gathers one. it, passing it back, and turns the ball over. And you know, we talked to get to Nikola pre-game. He seemed yeah. really dialed in. Yes, they are really into this. This is this means a whole lot to them. They're gonna be playing their hearts out. Yeah. Come on. 
and it will be a throw in for Belmont. Controlled by Sachel. Looks like the crowd's coming in here at Dribbling Field. through no the masses, and he turns the ball over. Alexander Duda yep. is our center to back Nicola. here. Nicola is getting a lot of touches this game. Yep. Smart. Cook wants oh. it. Oh. A mistake almost led to a goal for Belmont. Ooh. And it is controlled by Alex oh. Cook. Andrew's got to make a smart Andrew play Schreiner here. Andrew Schreiner tries to cross it in. It is deflected. To Nicola. Nicola. I think that's Owen Filler over there. On the wing. Try to split them. Can't. That's to Andrew. To Pat. Patrick takes a strike, and it is off. A little we, weak there. We like, that's to okay. we like to see him taking shots, though. That's his shot. That's what, that's what Pat lives We for. like to see him taking shots. Patrick's number seven. He is. Orange cleats out there. They really stand out. I like them, though. Yeah, I like them, too. Andrew Schreiner pressing on the ball. Serves going. And Does he get it? Thomas, the goalkeeper, is going to control that. It's a good pickup by Thomas. It really is. slows the game down. He's a very, very experienced goalkeeper. Stays very calm during the games. That's what you need out of a goalkeeper. That is. Yeah. Alexander Cook trying to go down the line, and it's deflected. Out of bounds. And Cook on the throw in. Down the line to uh, Daniel Lou is the intended Tries target. To it out. It's going to be Belmont ball. Alex Cook with another throw in. Quick off that throw. Tries to cross Looks it. Looks like it's going to be, be a, corner. a corner kick. Good. I think we're going to have number 10, Sachel Kenkray, take this corner. Shout out to Adam Erudwani for his photography for, this, for the team. He's gone to every single game, and he's getting great shots for them. Being so really committed to our team, to making edits. Shout out to him. This will be a corner. It's a good opportunity for Belmont. They've, they've converted corners on the past. In the past. In the past. Ooh. And That's tight. I think it's going to be another corner, corner to the other side. Yeah. From, from this. If you're looking for Adam, he's wearing blue jeans and a black hoodie. Mm. He's the one with the camera. He is. And it'll be another corner kick for Belmont. Kicked by Patrick Tang this time. And it's the good looking good. ball, and it is over the top. Looks like. And kept in, but it'll be a throw be in Belmont for Belmont. Ball again. Yeah. For another quick one to Andrew. Playing really fast. Oof. Ooh, yikes. That's all right. Looks like some. Some coaching coming from Neiman. Neiman's looking for more intensity out of the boys. He thinks they're looking a little slow right now, but the intensity will pick up as the game goes on, I think. Crowd's coming in. Yep. Harris Field. People just like to be fashionably late. I don't know why. Like, why can't you just be on time? That's what I think as well. But hopefully we'll be getting a good supporting crowd. As Sacho takes it out of bounds, it'll be... It's going to be a long throw in right into Alex. Bedford ball again. <laughs> right about 30 minutes left in this half. Yeah, controlled by Belmont. Belmont seems to be having a lot of possession this half. Great defensive effort. And it's a good header by serve. Yep. Nikola needs to get it down. Needs to get it down. Yep. Servitopoulos. And we see some Belmont soccer alumni coming in. Yeah, love to see alums. Supporting you guys watched last year. We see Andy and Lucas on the field, yep. on the stands. Love to see alums supporting, supporting the boys. Supporting the boys, yeah. And Belmont's pressing up, 
it is controlled by Servitopoulos, and he passes it to Schreiner, and they turn it over. Andrew's looking for that ball. Right to Owen. Back Owen to steps Edward. up. Pat gets it. And they control it in the back half. Switching sides over to Servitopoulos. Serves looking to clear it out. Ooh. A nice little one-two to Cook going down the line, trying to outspeed everyone. Ooh. He got pushed a little right bit there. Right at Bedford sideline. I, I saw a little push in the back. I don't know if you did, but. Looks like we're having a kick. Getting a little physical out there, I'd say. Yeah, it's getting heated out here. We like a little bit of physicality, though. Just got to keep it in check. No, let the you boys know. play. Let the boys play. Yeah. It's a good touch. And Ooh. Schreiner kicks it, and it's going to be controlled by the goalkeeper. And it is Nikola who kicks the ball. And don't quite control it, though. And going down the line is Belmont. Getting past the defender. Looks like, passing it to the middle. Like. Sachel for the shot. Ooh, oh, that's a good that was save. not Sachel. That was Daniel Liu. That was Daniel Liu. Apologies. Another Apologies. top goals, goal scorer. We're getting, we're getting shots on goal, though. That's what we want. So. That's what we want, yeah. They're just not falling. Exactly. They'll fall, though. Nikola with a header. No, Servitopoulos with a header. And it'll be out of bounds. Neiman's, Neiman's digging the hard work. He's liking what he's seen out of his players. He'll be out of bounds again. It'll be a throw in for... It's good defense. We want to clear it out. And... Duda lets the ball go out. It'll be Belmont ball on a goal kick. <clears throat> Thomas gearing up for a for, for a, a big, big kick here. Big kick, perhaps. We'll see how far he can kick the ball, though. And. There is a call on the play. I think it was foul. Patrick was hit in the back. Looks like his toes. And Nikola passes it in to Sachel, who beats two defenders and loses the ball. Back to Nikola. He might be looking for, maybe not, to Andrew. Five, five still on the ground. Getting up now. And a through ball. Attempt is failed, but another good another good try for Belmont. They're really getting things going in the offensive half. We got a sub coming in for Patrick Tang. Yep. Sam Cutsman, number six. Yep. Be on the lookout for him. Be on the lookout. He's a dangerous one. He is. Punt to Belmont's half of the field goes out of bounds, it looks. And it will be a timeout, timeout called. <coughs> Get some water, rejuvenate. It may be a long game. Out in the cold, you tend to feel fatigued more, so. A little bit dry air. Yeah, you need, you need to stay dehydrated. hydrated. Jinx. I'll need soda.
What are you thinking so far? I think it's going to be a good game. You know, I'm hoping Belmont can pull away with this one. I we do talk, too. We talked to the Medford's, Medford's head coach before the game. We did. We asked him who should be looking out for on their team. He said everybody. Yeah, he's feeling awfully confident, awfully confident for to be going up against such a strong team as Belmont. We've really had a very good end to the season. We've been very strong, and I think we have the potential to have a deep playoff run, perhaps. Me too, me too. Um, we've got the hunger. We've got the talent. We you know, hustle, to, hustle and heart keep us apart. So. They do. You know. They do. Um, so, yeah, we'll see how this goes down. Belmont's been looking like a very uniform. Belmont's been looking more dominant, would you say? Yeah, I'd say, I'd say we have – possession for most of the game mm -hmm. so hopefully we it stays that way and Keep we can convert up. a goal or two um, and we'll be starting up back again now with the throw in from Medford from Medford and Medford controlling the ball passing it around and turns it over Sochel's ball capitalizing on it Passing it to Daniel Lou. It's going out of bounds. Yeah. Could be Belmont ball. Yeah. Cook's there. He's at the spot. Yeah. Um, Medford controls the ball and is passing out in Servitopolis. Servitopolis Denies. wants it. Looks like a little bit of a foul there. It is. Got tripped up a little bit. It is. Um, and Belmont will be taking a free kick from about the 40. Nico and Schreiner going back and forth. Oh Ooh, gosh! And a good side tackle by Medford. Ooh, we're looking. We're going to a scrappy game now. And and Owen won it back. Good hustle. Good hustle. You know, if you get beat, you got to get back on defense faster. Don't you can't just sulk. So that, that's in all sports. That's that in is all in sports. all sports. So it's good to see that out of our boys, winning the back, winning the ball back over. And it is Shriner who kicks it. And, and so Medford a, on the attack. A little bit of a speed section, but in the end, it's gonna be, it's gonna be Thomas's ball yep. for another goal kick. It will. We'll Looks like there's there's it. some anger coming from coming from Medford's head coach. Yeah, he's getting in it right now. He was now. awfully confident in the beginning. I wonder what happened. Yeah. Me, me too, man. It's a decent touch, right and into the hands of Sochel, though. Yeah, more like the feet, but we'll take it. All right. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Um, Nikola. Nikola fighting for the fighting ball for and controls it. it. Love the hustle out of him. That's a good ball. Sochel wants it. Not Sochel. That's not Sochel. Nope. That's Dilu. Dilu fighting just as hard though. And if you're coming to any future Belmont games, we do have a have a snack stand. Yes. For pizza, popcorn, candy, water. Go, go support the uh, go support the our palms. local businesses. Yep. Palms, food, court. Yep. Medford with the cross, and it will be out of bounds. Thomas's ball again. Haven't really been on target lately. True. We're going to get the ball out quick. Servitopoulos. Number five, Alex Servitopoulos. He's been a really key defensive player for Belmont this year. He has. He's been a brick wall. Really. Sacho gets the ball, fights us. for it. Serve. Oh, that's not serve. That's it quick. will be, it looks like Belmont ball. Trying to go fast to Daniel Liu. And Medford comes up Cleared with it. Cleared out. I think that's Lawrence. I think that's a freshman for Belmont. Yeah, he's been really making his way on the Belmont really team. Really good, solid defender for us. Really plays, plays with heart. Really so, does. Really deserving of his position and keep it up. We have about 22 minutes left in the half.
and it is Medford with the ball, controlling it. And they send a ball into the box, which will be out of bounds again. Lots of bad balls coming from Medford. Um, none have been really on target, so hopefully they, they keep missing. And, and uh, none of them are, are good balls. Yeah, I hope, I hope Belmont, Belmont puts one in before the half. Really get in the heads of Medford here. True, true, true. A goal, a goal before half would really encourage the guys. I think a 0 0 score at half is makes you lose confidence. Medford on the attack, sending a ball in, and Thomas will control it. Getting it out quick, back to serve. Brings a left, back to Thomas. Thomas Big kick from Thomas. Boot it to Good Patrick header. Tang. Maybe not. Who does not control it. Look at a big frantic from Belmont here, but we get it back. Yep, and we turn the ball back over, but then now we get it again. Yeah, no, it's Belmont ball. It's uh, been a lot of changes of possession. No team has really been able to control the ball for over. Since, since the timeout. Yeah. But here comes Belmont with some good, some good footy. Sachel trying to go through players, and he gets fouled. It's a good fouled. call. It's a good call by the ref. Looking at another free kick. Sachel tries to go fast, giving it to Patrick Tang. Oh my gosh! Who it's does a little, little spin? A little spin a Little spin a And quick one two back quick to one Nicola. Two, Nicola. He's looking for a good ball here. Yep. A little fake. And choose to pass it back out. Smart play. No need to force anything. Medford clears it out to get it served. Good. Oh. To serve Tablas who misses but recovers. And Medford's on the attack now. Number 15 has nobody with him. So then he's gonna turn it over. Thomas Thomas's ball. Quick back. I think that's Lawrence over there. Yep. Back to what it looks like is filler. Mm -hmm. Can't really tell if I'm out here. Sachel pushes it up. That's a good ball. Sachel sends an amazing ball to Cook, who does not quite convert, but he's still on the press. And a press results in Ooh. almost a turnover for Belmont. They should keep pressing. It's working. It's working. Yeah. I, I know that's a big, it's a really big theme of Neiman's coaching. Yeah. Pressure, pressure, pressure. It's a word that you'll often hear from him. Yeah. Getting a little chilly out in. Yeah, it really is. Not a Harris Field. Harris Field, but still come out because we're committed. Yes. And so is Belmont's fans. Yep. Sachel has all the time in the world, looks for a ball. Right to D. Lou. Finds D. Lou, who gets by one it. defender. He wants it. Gets by two, and the third gets him. Ooh, oh, that's, oh, 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 oh. Mm, ref says no. No <laughs> call to that one. Yeah, ref says no but way. But that is debatable, I would say. And the ref's been calling a lot. So far, um, so you'd think they'd give him that, but at the same time, it's so close to the net that he wouldn't call anything soft. I'd say it's a good call. Cook um, on the throne. And Cook throws it into the box, and it'll be headed out by Medford. Controlled by Schreiner, who passes to Sachel. Sachel looking for something. He crosses the ball in, and nothing comes of it. Nicola tries to control the ball, recovers, and Sachel has it again. Belmont playing it slow, looking for something good. Eagle has an open field. Sachel with some pressure, makes a play, makes another one, passes it, intercepted. Serve gets it ahead of one. And, and that's going to be another foul. Yep. Serve is a strong, has a I mean, strong frame. 
Really and stays on his feet. Yep, 15 could not get around him that time. You know, they call him the brick, the brick wall. They do call him that. And for a good reason. For a good reason. For a good reason. He's really the, uh, the heart of our defense along with Alexander Duda. And, um, yeah. Um, Patrick Tang passes out to Schreider. Looking for something. Tries to play a ball into Cook. Pass it back out to Sacho. Looking for a shot. Finds Filler on the wing. Filler fighting for the ball, and he loses it. And... I don't quite know what the call was there. Me neither. <laughs> Looks like it'll be Medford ball. Medford throws the ball in, controlled by Nikola Stefanovic, who Ooh. beats his defender. What a good move by Nikola. Makes him fall almost. Patrick fighting for possession, and he loses that battle this time. But they wow. get it back. A bit scrappy. It is a bit scrappy. They're fighting for their placement. Ooh, looks like a bit of a foul in there. In the tournament. It's it is. do or die for both of these teams, so. And, you know, Bel Belmont's been really hopeful for a good season ever since that heartbreaking loss last year in the first round of the playoffs. Yep. They're, out for, they're out for revenge. They got a little chip on their shoulder, making a, looking Sir to make Topless a run here. To Cook down the line, and it's intercepted, but out of bounds, Belmont ball. Cook's looking to get it out. And fighting for it is... It's going to be Medford ball. Again? Who's that striker on Belmont? Andre. Andre, right. Andre Lushreiner, and there's Andrew Schreiner. I've, I've been told. Schreiner and Lushreiner, they call him. But Andre. It's their last names. Yeah. Andre has been um, a really good uh, cool scorer for reserve Belmont. striker who comes in cold off the bench and still does a great job. He's got a lot of goals this season. He does. You can identify him because he's wearing the gloves. It's also number 19. Yep. It's both of them. Looks like some good defense from Serve and Cook. Yep. Alex and, and Alex. Alex squared. Belmont recovers the ball. Cook is going down Ooh, the line. Ooh, looks like it's going to be another he foul. Gets fouled. 15 is racking up fouls. And Medford is Medford's, yelling. Medford's coach him. is looking a bit a bit upset there. I don't know, I don't know why he would be upset. Telling him to keep playing and don't mind the calls. I think that's a good message. I think that's what he said, actually. Hmm? I don't think that's what he said. That is what he said. Oh, really? Yeah, he was like... He said, get over there. He was like, get on with it. No. He said, get on with it, because the player was uh, right. sulking about a call. You know, you sulk, you lose. Exactly. Servitopoulos to Shriner. Shriner. Shriner turns it over. And is Medford on the attack. Goes nowhere. Or where that ball was to, but it was right to our keeper, Thomas. Yep. Double zero. Been a really good goalkeeper for, honestly, the whole the whole state this year. Only a junior sells a year ahead of him, or is he a sophomore? A sophomore last year. Still, yeah. still was our our starting goalkeeper last year as well. Yeah, definitely some young talent there. Definitely some young talent. He'll be ha he'll be elite next year as well. For the, in the team. lookout. And a good little floater. That is almost converted, but not quite. Looks like Andy, number four. You'll see him running on, taking out Owen Filler. Yep, Andy Penault, he's a great athlete. Really athletic. Mm -hmm. Small frame, but he gets it done. It's brutal. It's not nice. Nothing to guess him. <laughs> Got another sub from Medford coming he's, in later, he's, number he's eight. He's a flourishing basketball player as well, Andy is. Yep. Yep. 
Does he play the other sports? Or is he just a dual sport athlete? No, I think that's it for him. I think that's it. Hmm. Medford in the back. Nicolo looking to pressure. And a long ball to Lawrence. Is not converted. Pat has it. Gives it up. Nicola back to Medford. Fighting for it. You know, Medford's given these uh these long balls and they're just not nothing's coming of them. They, I think they need to build more from the back half and have smaller passes and make something happen rather than just yeah, some I, bombs. Yeah, I agree. You know? I think Bedford's looking a bit frantic. Beaumont's looking really composed out there, really knows what they're doing. Yep. And it's cleared by Medford and Servitopoulos with a Tough touch there, control. but he gets it back. Yep. Gets past number 15. Stays composed. Gives it up to Andrew. Andrew beats one there. and gets overwhelmed, but stays with it. Beaumont's doing a good job of staying with it. And serve takes a fall, but he's getting back up and recovering. Oh, and a good through ball by Medford. They're on the attack. We got to watch out here. A cross is out way over, and that is out of bounds. They tried, but that's all right. It's probably their best take so far, I'd say. And Thomas has it in that. He's going to see what he does. I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> and he kicks it to serve <laughs> yeah, he passes in it. the corner. Does not boot it. I think Back his to boot Duda. is more par. Back to serve. Subpar. Passes it. Oh, 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 and serve turns it over. Oh, this that is could dirty. be critical. Might be something awry here. But Belmont recovers very That's well. That's good defense. That's good defense by Belmont. Very good recovery. Put under pressure there, but you can see we get it back really yep. easy. But Medford still has it. Good turn. Shoots Ooh. in right over, right over the bar. Thomas is heated, yelling at his defense to get it together. He's mad about that one. But good recovery from Belmont after a little slip up, and it'll be Thomas in the net with the ball. A little scary, but I know our boys are going to keep in check. Yep. Get it back on the next one. We're going to see a big kick here from Thomas going down. That's field. a good boot. That is a good Kicking boot. it to the 50 is not an easy feat. It is not. I agree. So good. For I him. definitely could not do that. I couldn't. As either. we give it up to serve in the backfield. Yep. Serve. To Shriner, back to serve. Serve. Passing it to Andre. To Andre. To Sochel. Sochel's dribbling. Gets one. Passes it to Pat. Passes it back to Soch. Nice little footy going on here. Oh, Soch slips, it, but he keeps but it. He can do, oh, and what a Cook's good looking for ball. it. I think that was a little miscommunication. Alex wasn't going That's a good touch by Soch. Line. He's looking to get by number seven. Does he? He does. He does. Soch stays alive. Oh, and almost a good through ball, but Ooh. wow, the boys are slipping. It, it may be some frost or something, I, I think. I don't know. It looks a bit dirty from Mel Medford. I don't know. I thought he just slipped. No. no. Oh, yeah, no, no. Yeah, dirty from Medford. Dirty from Medford. <laughs> Must be a foul. Must be. Must be. It may be something with some, some frost on the turf from the cold, though. Could be making some guys slip. Making making things a little harder than usual. But the soccer guy played through all conditions. Another guy slips. I, Alex took ball. all over the place. Yeah, turf is maybe a bit wet. Maybe a bit wet. Yeah, but probably mostly just the fouls. I would yeah. Say. yeah. <laughs> Andrew, down that's the line. That's a good ball. And it's a good try. It's out of bounds, but yep. you know that's what we want from Belmont. That was a good ball. Was this the right idea? That's what counts. It's the right idea. Cook, See, header, a good header to Sacho, back to Schreiner, and Patrick Tain comes up with it, controlling. Nicola, back to. Back to Nicola, who finds Sacho in the midfield. Who goes a good ball to Andrew, but he doesn't come up with it. Andy with a kick, and it will be it's a, close a little one. wide. It was a bit rushed, but you know that's what we want from Belmont. We exactly. see a shot, we take it. Exactly, we love it. We like the shots on net. We're getting good shots. Keeping them on their toes, you know.
big boot by Medford, controlled by Belmont. This is what I'm saying. They just they're just booting the ball and not really controlling. Much. Kicking it down, hoping for something good to happen. Exactly. But we just Belmont's got a good defense. That's our do. strong suit. We just gotta hope they don't convert any of these. We got a good a good switch to the to the right kicks. side of the field. Sochel gets one. That's a good ball. Ooh. Cleared by Taken away. And gonna be controlled by Belmont defense, I hope. Actually not. Medford down the sideline beating Belmont defense and Looking the cross. For a cross here. Ooh, Thomas Ooh. taps it over. And that is a dangerous ball. That's a dangerous ball. It's really scary for Belmont careful. here. Thomas not quite getting the ball. If there was a striker on the back post, that would have been a goal. And it's gonna be it's gonna be a corner kick. And that's a scary ball. And cleared out finally. And Medford still controls. You gotta be careful. Andre down the line and it'll be out of bounds. Getting a runny nose from this cool. And it'll be Belmont in the back half controlling it. Schreiner on the breakaway tries to play through ball and it's no good. Cook pushing the pace. Down to the corner. And it'll be a corner kick, I think. Corner yep. kick. Yep. It's a good play. That's what we want. We're looking for a goal here. Yeah. We always love a good corner kick. It's a good opportunity, and it looks like a timeout has been called. Looks like there's four, just about four minutes left in this half. On timeout, did you, did you catch who it was? Belmont or Medford? Timeout Belmont? I think it was Belmont. There's been two timeouts called this half. It's not common, I think. Is it? I don't think so. I think usually teams don't call timeouts as often, but the boys are locked in. Still 0-0 here. Um, good looks from both teams, so it's really any man's game, I would say. As we see, te both teams <laughs> huddled up. Obviously, <coughs> Medford's looking to make a change to their strategy. Hasn't really been working yeah. so far. Belmont also looking to do the same, but we've got a lot more shots on goal, so. True. I notice they don't add in the 456 family to their chant. I wonder why. Maybe they're not a family. I don't know. The Marauder family. I I'm just wondering where it's at, you know. As Belmont takes the field and Medford is still trying to hash things out. Their coach seems a little bit heated, not happy with Medford play right now. We'll see. Looking at a corner kick from Sochel Kenkre once again. Yeah, he plays great balls into the into the box, so yes, we'll see if he can place called, this yeah. one well. Yeah. Yeah, the box. Yeah. Yep. Belmont has had good set plays from the box to be able to convert. Um, goals, so we'll see how this one goes. It's a great opportunity. And here it comes. Across. A little short. And that was a miss by Sacha. That's alright, though. Move on to the next play. Um, you know, it's a little slippery. He could have just slipped a little bit. It'll be Medford taking it out of the goal. Medford, as Medford brings it up this half, 
They're really desperate to score a goal here. They really want to put Belmont away early. We know True. that Belmont is typically better in the second half than they are the first half. And there's a sub in number two. Do we know who that is? I think that's Max Couch. Made a really good play there. He, fresh legs coming onto the field for Belmont. Making Max Cash. Making back a, already. Yep, making a good play. I think he's an underclassman, so we love to see that. As Nico plays good defense. And you know, we, we, we interviewed some of the Belmont players before, before this game, and one of their players, Patrick, Patrick Tang, he was saying that losing is not an option tonight. Really, he told you that? Yeah. No, they really, they got their whole hearts into this, and um, they're playing for everything. I mean, some of these seniors, this could be their last game they ever play, so it's really an important moment for them as they take on Medford for this round one of the Middlesex tournament. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's going to be thrown for Belmont, thrown into the box, balls up in the air, and it gets controlled by Medford, who boots it out and clears it. Due to number 13, who I haven't seen too much of this game, but yeah. in previous games, he's made a really big, really big impact on the he team. Has. Even been named a late captain he was. for our team. He was promoted captain. Previously, it was Nikola, number 21, Nikola Stefanovic, and Sachel Kenkre, number 10, both wearing the captain band. But if you look on the field, number 13, the white white long sleeve undershirt, also Ooh. has the captain band along his, along his left arm. A good play there by Medford just then. Um, couldn't do anything of it, but they are getting good looks. Um, Looks like it's going to be Medford Ball. Indeed. Number 14 comes on for Medford. Number 8. Subbing off number 8. He's a little um, slow to come off there, but that's all right. <laughs> maybe he's tired. He's been working so hard. I don't think he has. Uh, maybe he's hurt. Maybe they're just not conditioned. You know, I've seen, I've seen Belmont soccer run miles on miles for practice. They do have an intense training regimen. I don't know if any of you, anyone watching has run the ladder, but it is no fun in Belmont. Oh, and that was a really close. That was a close one. Close goal. Good look by Belmont. Another good look. One of these times they probably will the convert. probably the closest one of of today's match. Yep. <clears throat> Except for that one by Medford, but and it will be Medford in the backfield. I know Neiman has really been wanting that pressure off those goal kicks. You yep. know, running up real fast, pressuring them to make a fast. Yep. And that'll be the half play. Two, two. Um, both teams are doing well. It looks like a pretty even match with Belmont. I'd say controlling the ball a little bit. More. I, I talked to the rest yep. during the halftime. We got Patrick Gravlin. Yep. And the other guy's name is Steve. Just we did Steve. not get a last name on Steve. Yeah, but he didn't, he, yeah, he seemed a bit uh, stingy with that one. Yeah, right. that's all right, though. But And then there's there's like Keedy. Keedy. And that's got to oh, be a foul. That's got to be a foul. Yep. It is. Yep. Going it down. Is. We good, want the ball back. Good take by Phil. That's going to be Sacho's kick right yep. there. This is he better, again, hopefully again he, his he bread and butter. That. He's a great free throw. On, on not the free left throw, side, free kick. He's not, a great, not, great free kick. It's uh, going to be, it's shooter, gonna be so. a bit of a hard shot. I think here, he'll probably cross this, and I think that's the best bet. What do you think, Taylor? I'm a, I'm agreeing here. Yep. Looks like. It's and what that's he's a doing. good. That's a great ball. <gasps> and it's. <gasps> oh my oh, gosh! And that was what really good. What a great. Good. That was really it's good. Okay, it's okay. What a great play. That was a close one. What a great ball by Sacho. Um, they're really, we're get, that's a great first look at the beginning of the half. Hopefully we'll have many more. The intensity is looking up. It is, it is. As we see, all the pressure just got amped up. Yep. Boys are really and fired up Here comes up after Medford on the attack, bringing it back. Number nine, been a key player for Medford so far. He has. He's been holding it down for them. 
and they'll be out of bounds by my ball. Pizza looks good. I'd be down for some pizza right now. Ooh. It will be Belmont throwing. It'll be Alexander Cook throwing it in to Schreiner. And Servatopoulos clears the ball. It'll be Medford in the back, in the back half. Nico controls it, looking. And Filler tries to beat his man, and he does. Gets grabbed a little bit, but he's going down the sideline. Crosses the ball, incomplete. And Balmas doing a good job maintaining possession so far. Not forcing anything. And here comes Sacho with a cross. No, it looks like a shot, but that'll be an easy save for the goalkeeper. The Medford goalkeeper also can kick it to about the 50. Dog roaming the whole stands right now. Being a lookout for a brown and white dog. <laughs> It'll be Sachel taking the ball in. Sachel's getting past one. Pushing the pace so here. Switching the pace here, yeah. Pushing oh. it, not switching it. No, no, he's like he's going fast. He's like doing he's both. Yeah, he's, he's doing switching both. it up. He's switching it up. Yep. Give it a Lawrence. And it is cleared, but Lawrence. Lawrence. Lawrence um, Again, our freshman. Is he a freshman, really? Yeah, he is. Very impressive. Freshman or sophomore, that's impressive. And Belmont fights to recover. It's going it to be offsides. It's going to be offsides. It's a great call by our ref. I think that's, uh, I think that's Steve over there. I think that's Steve. Good, Good call, job, Steve. Steve. We love you. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Maybe that's Keedy. I don't actually know. Well, they go hand in hand, you know. Oh, wait. Maybe that's Patrick Gravelin. And I don't know Ooh. what the call here will be. Holding, maybe? Was that holding or something? Telling Nikola to bring Push the, the ball, ball back, back. Right, a there. Bit. Yep, right there. Right there. Got it the perfect. Got it perfect. And Nikola has the ball, passing it to T. Lou. Patrick Tate tries to control it. Filler is Filler wants chasing it. after it, and he doesn't get it. But he he does actually. That's a good that's a good clear Medford by, by Medford. It. But yep. And their striker controls and is on the attack. Duda's now. really focused. Duda's locked in. Good defense by Duda. That's good Passes defense. Out. Shadowing his the defender. Cross. They get the cross, but it's out of bounds. Good defense by Belmont. Yeah, that's Steve. The ref is Steve on our close end. Is it Steve in the purple? Oh, they're both in purple. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 Some weak kicks by, by Medford over here. And here's Sotchel in the up. press. Sotchel's up. Still going. Pressure's there. And Nicola's Nicola press now. Too, and it to pays Pat, off. They turn it to over. To And we're looking to run down the field. Yep. To Pat. Good pass to Dilu, who's oh, he through gets, the defense. That's Dilu, not Pat. He's going to have a good look, and it's a oh. save. Good look by Daniel Liu. Breaks, and that was a great play by Belmont. Breaks the line. Really getting the ball down the court. Wait. The ball down the field. Good touch by, by Cook. Daniel did a great job of breaking the defensive line there. For Lawrence, and Lawrence the header. Yep. Medford, the header. Medford controls it. Sochel gets it. Sochel easily recovers. A little bit of a foul out. there. It's called. And it is called by our trusty, our trusty, trusty I referees. Think that's, yeah, I think that's uh, Gravelin. Gravelin. 
What was his first name? I don't know. Max? I, I wonder no. where that where Gravelin is from. Wait, that's true. And Sacha with the shot, Ooh. and it, it looks to be deflected. And Ooh! Oh, Ooh! He, that's going to be a corner. That is Big mistake. Corner. Big mistake by their... By Corners their are close. underrated. A, a good corner. Ooh. And the student crowd is standing up. Student section is standing up. Getting a bit up. of a rumble going. I don't know if you can hear that on the mic, but it's pretty lively over here at we might, Belmont's we might get a Harris Category Field. Category 2 earthquake up in Harris Field right now. Named after Bowden Harris's family. Nope. Nope, it's not. But shout out to Bowden Harris. He's a great player for the varsity soccer team. And who's taking it here? Patrick. That's be Patrick Tan. Patrick takes That's a good cross. That is a good cross. The back post goes but it's over. a little too far. It looks like bit, Andrew Schreiner's being fast. taped up on the sideline. Hopefully he's okay. I'm sure he's going to go back in. That's a good kid. Good heart. He is a good kid. Oh, that's a good touch the by ball Lawrence. Is controlled by Patrick Tang. Pass that to Filler. To, Inside to Nicola. To Sochel. To Sochel. Gets it by. Good sequence. Really wants it. Keeps Sochel. the ball to Pat. Slicing and Dyson. Slicing and Dyson. I like that one. And Filler wants it. It'll be out of bounds. It's going to be out of bounds. Goal kick, Medford. See our, our athletic director Adam Pritchard walking over now. Yep. I don't two, know what that has to do. Two briefcases. Don't know what he's carrying. Probably the, uh, violas, I would assume. Medford with a kick, and Thomas was caught outside of the net. Medford was trying to trying to capitalize on that, but they could not. That's going to be, uh, what's the call here? Looks like it's going to be Medford free kick at about the 30. They're going to try to cross it in. A lot of, a lot of chatter coming from Belmont. <coughs> yep. Always known to have some good communication. Got to make sure they're on the same page Looking here. for seven to have a free kick here. Yep. And... Owen Filler is a one-man wall right now. And that's dangerous territory, Clear. but they cleared out. Sasha's Sacho's looking to bring it all the way. Oh, that's a good a ball. ball. Dilu wants it. What Number nine wants it, too. Who has Dilu it? Dilu breaks one defender. He shoots. Deflected. Oh. Caught by the took goalkeeper. Took too long. Took too long. But that's what we want. A little bit of hesita hesitance there, but that was a great play. The crowd is buzzing great now. cross by Sacho and a great run by Dilu. proves to be a Dilu. great game. As we predicted. And you know, it is the playoffs. It's 0 0 right now. It if this continues, we will go to overtime. Oh my we God, will that's go to penalties. Right. That's right. There can be no ties Exciting. in the playoff game. Exciting. I have a feeling if we if we do go to playoffs, our boys have nerves of steel. Penalties. I have a. Or penalties. penalties. Yeah, yeah. Penalties, I think we'll have that down. Um, but here we Alex have. Alex Cook back on the field. Cook. Haven't seen him in a while, but. Making an impact already. Pat wants it. He's going to take a shot. Patrick takes a shot, and it is off. But we love to see shots being taken. We love to see them. It's going to be Medford ball. Uh, goal kick. And... It's going to be Belmont and Medford fighting for possession. It looks like it'll be Medford ball on the throw in. Um, looks to be a Belmont throw in now. They're going to be looking downfield. 
Patrick Chain controls it, um, but loses the ball. They're fighting for possession. And Sachel comes up with it, looking to cross the field. Nikola looking to turn. He tries to play it in, and it's deflected. Nikola plays it back to Thomas. Thomas with composure. Pass it back to serve. Yep. Back to Nikola. Bringing it up the field to Sochel. Gets a nice touch in. Looking to cross it over, it looks like, but he gives it to gives it back to serve. Change of speed. Sochel. Again. Going keeps through it. one, two, loses no, the ball. 24 is looking to clear it, he does. Lawrence gets a good, gets a touch, gets a touch. Gives it to Andrew Schreiner, to Pat. Switch, gives it back to Andrew. Looking for a good ball here. Belmont wasn't ready, but that was a good play. Dilu gets the ball. controlling it, trying to fight through defenders, and he doesn't manage to. It'll be out of bounds, Belmont ball. Owen Filler has it. He gives it up to Dilu. That's quick. Doesn't look like Medford was ready for that one. Yeah. To Sochel. They, do a, they make a point of having quick, uh, quick, balls. quick balls. Looks like a bit of a push there. It's not. Medford's ball. Throw in. Yep. And pressure by Lawrence and yeah. everybody else on the and team. Nikola pressure is leads Andrew to gets a the turnover. Ball. Andrew taped up but still going strong. Tries to find a Patrick good cross in the middle and he switch. does. Wait. Yeah. Switch, yeah. It's a switch. Yeah. Serve gets it, plays it back to Cook. And it looks it's gonna be a to foul be, yeah. right where Patrick is. It's going to be a free kick for Belmont, controlled by Nikola Schreiner. Takes space, goes for a shot, and... This is another one. You know, shots haven't really been on target, but we've been getting the right by. looks. We, we have, do what we, we want start. to, and when we want it, the ball's just not going in the net. That's all it is. Yep. <clears throat> we just got to convert one of these. That's all we need. I trust our defense to have a clean sheet as long as we just me get too, a goal. Me too, me too. That's all we need. We had trouble last year getting goals. We had a whole lot of 0-0 ties with an amazing defense, but just not sufficient offense. So hopefully Belmont can convert this game. Quick to get Owen fill of the ball to throw into Pat, or to Andrew to Pat. Back to Pat. Yep. He's gonna, Patrick he's gonna beats get his defender. Five. That's a good move That's by Patrick. That's a good switch. Nikola. Nikola, looking to take a shot looking here, does he? Shot. Andrew he's wants it, with the does ball he? And doesn't get the goal. Save. But we get another That's shot right. on that goal. We're, we're, doing we're getting well. in their heads. We're getting in their heads. You we know, are. possession have been almost all Belmonts this half. Don't yep. want to jinx it, but they're on their toes. It is what it is. And as here comes Medford, but it will be out of bounds. The ball is out. It's going to be Belmont ball. We've got quite the student section now so coming out to support the boys. We love to see it. Got over a. Got over 200 fans here today, estimated. <laughs> yeah, at, at first Creep, glance, Creeping up to that 300 range. I would say so as well. And we have hand Hey, that's got to be a handball right, right hand there. Yep, yep, there it is. Yep, yep, yep. And Lauren gets it, good gives eye, it to Andrew. Good eye, good eye, ref. Quickly to Soch. Good eye, Stripes. And Sochel is... Got to be Steve who made that call. Beat, trying to beat, and he crosses it to nobody in particular. They had nobody. It's probably a shot and goal. They had nobody on the far post there, so that was a good look by Sachel, but no one there to help him. We have a really high ball. A boot might be making a header here. Going Brutal. around to the 45 line. 
It's a good header by Pat. Yep. Nikola pressures. Nikola pressures leading to a turnover. Bum on ball. Good pressure by Nikola. He's been consistent all game. Pressing really has. the ball, having a lot of heart. He's, As we he's suspected, we haven't lost focus, but ball's back in Medford's hands. They and push it back to the, the press by back to number four. Man. Switches it to the left side of the field. Andrews really running to get that ball. They want it. And Medford I think is making I, a play here, and they the ball gets deflected, and Belmont clears it out. Dealu chasing after the ball, and he manages to come down with it. He's fighting for it, but loses it. Yep, um, it's gonna be it's gonna, gonna be, be Belmont kick. Belmont yep, kick. Yep, it's yep. gonna be a foul on Medford. Another good call by Stripes there. We love to see it. Just around 22 minutes left. Well, 23, but yeah. Why do you guys say that? Oh, I'm sorry. Yep. Yeah. It's all right. Anywho, um, it's a good Belmont kick by Sochel. Crosses it in and it's gonna close. be it's gonna be a goal kick, I think. Good ball, but deflected by Belmont. No, it'll be a corner kick actually. Um, it's gonna be Sochel who's taking this one. Sochel messed up his last corner kick, but hopefully he we call fixes it, correction. We call it goldfish memory. You gotta have short term memory, you know. Yep. Forget about the pass. Just take move on to the next. So hopefully he has a good cross in. And it looks like it. It looks like it is. Back post. Patrick doesn't come up with it, but it looks like it'll be a goal kick. We got two subs coming in from Medford here, number seven and number eight. Yep. And they're coming in for number 20 and number 14. Indeed. <laughs> See Neiman making some quick Quick offensive switches here Some to our game plan, it looks like. Say. And Medford boots the ball up to the half. They've been booting the ball up the whole game, just hoping something will land. So far, it hasn't. And I hope it stays that way. We've got some chatter from the stands here as Dilu comes up with the ball, tries to get past his defender, but he doesn't. Yep. And Belmont Nikola has it, gives it up to Andrew. Splits, splits two. Good slide tackle, but we keep possession. Sochel wants it, crosses it to Nikola. Nikola. Nikola's trying to push it up to Patrick. <coughs> Good Back pressure to Nikola. by Medford, and they come up with the ball. Ooh. And Owen has been hit in the weight room, as you can see. Better not let the emotion get the best of him, though. You can't be giving up fouls. Got to stay level-headed here. Yep. Clear that the emotions are rising. Yep. Score is still 0 0 with just and about 20 minutes eight left. Here's number 8 clapping in his face. Owen's got to stay, stay locked in. You got you to gotta show, show it, not say it. So. Sochel's looking to pressure them. So is Cook. Do they get it? They don't. Serve right on him. To Nicola. Looking to clear. Gets a bit of a foul there, but there is none. No call there. The ball continues to be played, and. Shriner kicks, kicks it, it out, of out of bounds. Good play by Shriner, smart decision. It's better than a goal. True. 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 Also, it would be dangerous to pass it to Thomas there. It's getting chilly out here. It is getting chilly. Hands going numb, but. I'm going to have to do some jumping jacks. We did walk around during halftime trying to warm up. Yes, we did. It's going to be a, a shot on goal, and that is a close one. Oh, my God. That is a close one. My heart skipped to be there, did yours? Really did, really did. <laughs> and, you know, Thomas has been one to get those balls yeah. today, but that was luckily that one wasn't in that corner. But Yeah, hard shot on that by, by Medford. And Thomas is going to boot it to about Over the, the 50. 50. To the 55. That's a good ball. Patrick's ball. We've got a Medford Looking to get a big down. ball here. Oh, Owen Filler looking to score, crosses it. it, bang, goal! Goal! Yeah! D-Lou, Owen Filler to D-Lou. And that's the first point of tonight's game. Here we go. Big goal for Valmont here. The boys here. are buzzing. Looking to steal it away. The boys are buzzing. About 19 minutes left in the half. They've got one. The score is now 1-0 Belmont. 
That was a beautiful goal. Crowd's buzzing now. Yes. The folks are on their feet for this one. Not just the students, the parents now. Yep. God, it's an all ages show here at Harrisfield. You know, we don't discriminate. Yeah, you didn't hear us? Yeah, we yelled it. We yelled it. Yeah. yeah. We've got some parent complaints now, but we're taking it. We're taking it. <laughs> that was great. And the timeout has been called probably by Medford, I'd assume, because they got to get it together. Um, it's a beautiful goal. Beautiful goal. Yeah, beautiful goal. It looked like a Medford player was was uh, was injured there. A little the bit half. upset about that one. Seems like. As you see, our previous Medford coach that was making a lot of noise is now silent. Wonder what happened. I I wonder as well. <laughs> um, Time stopped at 1917. Yep. One zero. Belmont, Belmont needs winning. to maintain composure. They can't. They can't let uh, this well, goal get Medford to their heads. Is, Medford's looking to bite back after that one. But yeah, I'm sure they're going to come out with a sense of urgency that Belmont needs to maintain as well. So hopefully. I think, I think now Belmont's, yeah. Belmont's in their heads. We just got to make a play a little too fast for their liking. <clears throat> keep, keep them frantic. Keep Belmont stay composed. Keep up the pace for sure. They gotta feeling confident now, but still gotta keep us keep us in check. You never know what they have up their sleeves, so you gotta stay alert. True. Happy but not satisfied. Yeah. And Medford is still in the huddle, using every second they have to devise a game plan. See the water boy coming off with the, the water bottles. He was the one who was clapping in, in Owen, Owen Filler's face. And look where that got him. Funny how that's what, that's what I like to say. Show it, don't say it. Owen Filler showed it, and this guy said it, and now we're up 1-0. Look what happens. Owen Filler with a great ball just to recap. There we go. To D. Lou with an amazing finish. Yep. Through the hands of the keeper. I love it. Right to the back of the net. Beautiful soccer, though. It is beautiful soccer. And... We the ball is in play. Medford booting the ball down again. And we they want. keep doing this. I don't it's not working. They gotta figure something else out. And it looks to be Medford ball. Nicola header to Sacho. Sacho on the, mixes on the offense. Back to Nicola. Looking for a through ball. Takes it himself. To Owen. To Owen again. Crosses. Schreiner in the back corner. That's goal! a goal! Goal! Goal by Andrew oh Schreiner! Oh my gosh, and that's that another was beautiful. amazing play. That's that another amazing beautiful. play. Beautiful. We love to see it. Two and that's two goals under in minute. under three minutes. Three minutes. Maybe a minute. You never maybe, know. Maybe one minute. Yeah, maybe a minute. You never know. You never know. What a beautiful sequence of events. Really getting in the heads the of Medford Belmont here. By the Belmont Marauders. And now I'm feeling more more comfortable with this lead. You know, we got 18 minutes left. Game's not over, but we sure are feeling the chills from, from Medford over here. They're looking a bit cold, looking a bit desperate. Yep. But we keep in possession. Gonna Going to play good defense here. Nicola coming and Nicola up. Nicola gets it inside Back on the Sasha, offense again. Looking for again. another goal here. Get, gets looking past for a one. third. Gets looking. past. Gets uh, back to Nicola. Back to Nicola. Nicola passes it to nobody. To he thought. I he think thought, he thought. I think um, he thought Filler was there. I Wasn't he, there at that time. But he may have mistaken the ref for a player. That happens. It's all right. Hey, and that, that's a mistake. But keeping you know, his head like, in the game. Like, like my fellow commentator said before. Yep. You know, you gotta have goldfish memory. You exactly. You, Exactly. You forget it, you know, we learn. Purple resembles maroon slightly, I would say. Oh, it doesn't. More than it re resembles white, so. Oh! That looks like a bit of a foul and there. And D. Lou got hit hard dirty, by bit, the defense. They might be getting a little angry at the outcome of this game, and they're using their, using their physicality now, so you got to watch out. Sochel steals that one. Cleared about five yards. 
And Nikola gets Nikola it back. That's a good touch controls. by Nikola. Stays composed. Learns from his mistake. Shriner. As we know. Back to serve, who boots it. And it looks to be Belmont ball in a throw in. We're rounding up on uh, 17 minutes. We had two amazing goals there in the time span of about two minutes. Really sealing the deal for Belmont here. We just got to maintain good cross. Controlled in the backcourt by Belmont. Deflected. And... It's going to be a corner for Belmont. Medford won't be able to keep it's it It's going to be a corner for Belmont as we see Patrick Tang, number seven, run into yep. the corner. Here he comes. He's had a few good corners in the uh Haven't been able to finish as he kicks game. that ball up. Yep. Pretty cool. But we'll see. We'll see how it goes this time. Looking for another goal to really seal away this game here. Yep. And... Here he goes. Arms up, kicks it. Good goal. Good ball. Oh, what a good ball! That was Not an amazing able to ball. Put it in. No one was there to find it, but great ball by Patrick Tay. He's recovered from tearing his MCL last year. Heartbreaking injury for Patrick. He missed a he lot made. of his season and had trouble recovering, but here he is. Little. Little history about Patrick Tang. He made varsity as a sophomore along with captains Sochel Kenkre and Nikola yeah. Stefanovic. Looking to make a really nice junior season, but that injury really kept it from that. As you can see, he's making up for it in yeah. his senior season. He's Last back, one, got to make a count. Staying fully healthy up until now, and knock on wood, will continue to do so. You know. And if you look to the midfield, we have number 19, Andre LaShriner, and number 6, Sam Kutzman, coming in. And here comes Dialu. Looks to be by himself almost, but a Medford defender keeps up with him. And it will be... Subs come on. Belmont ball. We've got Samuel Kutzman and... Samuel Kutzman coming in for Le Schreiner. Schreiner subbing out... The two goal scorers Schreiner of today's match. Schreiner and Dialu. Two goal scorers of today's match. We get a loud applause for these two young men who did a great job. Neiman hugging it out. Great sportsmanship from our coaches to our players. That's what we like to see. We love the camaraderie of our Belmont team. Belmont throws it in. Booted uh, out of bounds and it will be... Melrose ball. A little bit of a iffy touch there, but yep. ball goes down the Medford field. Medford on the attack and serve the brick wall. Gets it out. Gets it out. Back to Medford's hands, though, as we see our, as we see our pressure really coming into play here. Serve. And serve kicking it out. Another defensive effort by Alexander Servatopoulos. He's been great this game. Not too much action on the defensive side, but when we need him, he's when there. When it comes down there, it's up, it's up to serve Alex Duda and Lawrence to get that ball out, and they do every time. They do. They're our, they're our backbone of the team, and they really keep us together. Throw in by uh, Melrose. Clear by A little, a little by discombobulated over there by Medford, but... Oh, you said Melrose. Med Medford. Yeah, Medford. I apologize. No, it's okay. I, I mean, my M towns, I mix them up, you know. Yeah, there's a lot of M towns here, and they're all the opponent to me, you know. It's a good touch by Nikola. Nikola controlling it. Gets by it. one. Gets, Gets by it one. By another. Gets by two. Oh, he's oh. not able to keep that ball as he runs back on defense. He leaves the, the ball behind. Here comes Thomas. Cheeky out of the out of the box there by Thomas. Really. Really risk it for the really biscuit there, but, there, but it did he, pay pr off. he predicted the uh, offsides, so. It did pay off. Yep. And it will be a free kick for Belmont. See Lawrence, Lawrence call. taking it, but number 17 on Med Medford seems to be hurt. No. Sitting down over there. Where's he at? Oh, 
We've got Sarkis. See number 19 coming in for him instead, but Sarkis, told our to stay back beloved bit. trainer at Belmont High School, rushing over to see what the problem is. We love him. Great PE coach as well. You know, well. I, I talked to Sarkis before this game. He said he's looking for a good game, but he's really confident in um, Belmont's, Belmont's skill. He's watched a lot of our games this year, and he, he really thinks we could put this one away. Yeah. As we see, you've done a lot of research on this game. I actually did talk to Sarkis. That's a true fact. I believe it. And he hits the curt jog off of the field. <laughs> and the Boston Bruins looks like hat. everything's okay. And the you ball know, I, is I back like, in play. I like that leg strap from Sarkis. It's pretty nice. Yeah, it's a, it's a it's a nice addition. It's it's a yeah. Nikola gets by his defender. It's an athletic it trainer. It's a trainer fashion statement. Looking I'd for say. a good ball. Oh, a good ball by Patrick Tang into a little Cook. fast, but. Cook trying to maintain possession, and he cannot, but it looks to be... Whose ball is it? No idea. Oh, Cook is hyped. It looks Cook to be is a, fired it looks up. Like it looks a, like it's going to be a corner. Be a corner. Sochel, Sochel lines up to take this kick. Sochel probably our, our best... Uh, <laughs> Sochel our best uh, corner kicker, probably. Corner kicker. <coughs> And the ref a pause is in the play. It, it looks like there's some chatter. A little bit of rough from housing. Andre Lashiner and the and the goalkeeper. A little bit of rough housing in the box there. It looks like. But the fans are still on it. All right, here we go. Kick is in. Back post. <gasps> oh my God. Oh. oh. And the ball was dangerously close there to being a third goal for Belmont on that corner kick. As Medford now tries to take the offensive. And they cannot. It's a clean, it's a clean tackle by Belmont yep. over there. There's a no call here. Sam fired Sam up Cutsman. after that header. Keeps the ball. Cutsman maintains. Keeps it going down. Gets by his defender. And he is weaving Gives it up to Sochel. Sochel around his defender. He's trying Gets to by beat him. him. And he does not. It's out of bounds. Yep, yep, yep. It's going to be Medford ball coming Hello. down. got about 10 minutes left in this game. Belmont is up 2-0. Closer we get, the more certain it looks like we're going to get a W this time. It's about 10 minutes left in today's game. I just said that. Oh, oh. Yep, really? It's okay. My fault. Yep, yep, yep. Don't worry. You can say when it's like five. All right. All right. Yeah, I'll take that. Belmont clearing the ball. Shriner, Andre Lushriner. Lushriner. <coughs> and Stripes is calling that the other way. Hands in the air by Sochel there. Doesn't think it was a foul. Me neither, honestly. I think that's an iffy call by, by Steve. No, Steve is there. The Cratchlin? Other, the other one. Cratchlin. Yeah. Maybe. It's gonna be Medford ball. Yep. Another iffy call. Duda's hands are in the air now. Alex Duda, number 13. Now captain. Now captain Duda. Holding down the defense for us. He's been great this game as well. The crowd is opposing the call as well. I personally didn't see it. It's a little far from here. Free kick for Melrose. They kick it in, and it's going to look to be a... Oh, Ooh, and that's no goal. Man. No goal, no goal. That was that really scary. That was a close Left me speechless. Left me speechless. For Belmont. But, you know, Thomas Thomas, Thomas takes a size of re yep. side relief as he gets that one yes. in his hands. Just barely gets up, keeps that ball out of the net. And now Filler is booting it up to the Shriner, who is in a one-on-one -on -one situation, and he hasn't come up with it. Or maybe Looking he, back to get the ball, but, but he recovers. And he does get it. Get, get, gets it. He does get it. Yep. And down to Nikola Stefanovic. Nikola who's looking, looking for to get another ball. It's gonna be. Oh. It's gonna be a corner. He's hitting it's him. They're corner. hitting him hard. Nikola looks like he's hurting there a little bit. Looks like a bit of a rough play there. Probably just a rug burn though, or a turf burn. Oh, it's gonna be a throw. -in. It's gonna be a throw, -in. or a corner. Wait. But we have Owen Filler who has a cannon of an arm for throw-ins. He can practically. Throw it all the way to the box, so we'll see how we I'm, set up for I'm him. I'm pretty here. sure he's taking the corner. 
Oh, wait. Oh, he's throwing it. He's throwing yeah, he it can from throw, the corner. He can throw it real far. He does have a cannon so, of an arm. I'm so looking we'll for see. There he goes. Boom, there it is. And not quite, but Niko Savanovic kicking the ball in the box. Nothing comes of it. Sam steps up. And the ball is ball cleared comes towards out. This, the fans. Patrick gets it. Patrick. Good touch by Patrick. Out of bounds. It's going to be Medford ball. Ooh. Now Patrick's hands are up in the air now. It's going to be some iffy calls from Steve. And There's a lot of hands in the air. Pratchett. Um, Medford looking for an offense opportunity here. That's a good defensive play by Alex Duda. Duda clamps him up. As, as Filler and Patrick looks to get it down the court. Field. The field. Yep. Field. It's all right. We're basketball players, so, you know. Oh, looks like a bit of a foul gotta there. That's got to be going down. Yep. There we and go. And it is, and it is. We're Nicola, gonna play it fast. Trying to play it fast. Slowing down a little bit now. We should slow down. We got we got seven minutes left, and um, we're just trying to waste some time here now, probably. It's gonna be a timeout. It's gonna be a timeout from from Belmont. <laughs> I it was over. <laughs> yeah. As we heard before, losing is not an option for Belmont. It is not, and it looks like it won't be the option. And it looks like, like they it. kept to their promise. It is looking... 2-0 with seven minutes left in the game. Don't want to yeah. speak too soon, but it looks like we're going to close Belmont this one out. Belmont scored two goals in practically a minute, so you can never be sure. You can never be sure, but we will be knocking on wood here. We will be. Yeah. Yep. Medford looking a little bit demoralized, I would say. As they face elimination as the, as I in would this as playoff well. run, facing the what seed is Belmont? We got some of the crowd leaving. Maybe they're first. they're certain that we're winning, but you know they're leaving. Not too as soon. committed. See. The alum are still here. Surprising. I would have thought they left here. by now, but they're just that committed to uh, watching our guys. They had an unfortunate end to their season as seniors last year, so they're living vicariously through these guys, I'd say. And here we go again. Belmont taking their time to get back on the court field. Back on the field. And it will be Belmont ball at a free kick around the 50. Nikola Stefanovic Stefanovic will be taking it. No, he won't. That'll be Alexander Duda actually. Looking to kick it to Sachel and he manages to. Looking to get a looking to get a goal here. Sachel looking for a Ooh. goal and he doesn't manage to get it, but he gets it back. Oh, he doesn't even know where the net is. But he mixed up that whole team. <coughs> Great moves by Sachel, just can't quite find the back of the net. And it'll be. You know, Sachel has been one to. Get by all those defenders. Can't wipe, can't quite put it in there, but he's great technical ability. And Medford clears it. Will be cleared by Medford. Credit right to the head of Filler. Sam kicks it to the midfield where Sacha's waiting. Serve, beats his defender. Servitopoulos gets it out, not a corner. Good play there by Servitopoulos. He's been holding it down the whole time for the defense. Doing an amazing job. Led in zero goals so far. There have been some close calls, but. And Melrose with a shot deflected by Duda. Patrick trying to clear it, doesn't manage to. Another shot deflected again. In that's a close that's one. Gonna be Looking another to corner. be a corner kick. 
This is dangerous. This is dangerous. This is it is. Dangerous. We're sitting comfortably at a 2-0 lead. This would put us in a bit of a, a bit of a pickle. We want more than a one-point differential here. It's good for standings and it's good for uh, for just feeling more secure. More beef going down in the box. Looks like looks like our ref doesn't doesn't really like how the uh, Thomas is the the the, the, uh, kick is set up. the players trying to get in front of Thomas distort his vision. It's good defense. That's a Salter play. brings they it down the court. Do. Gives it up to Lashiner. Lashiner. Shriner going down the gets line. His, gets by his defender. Him. And it's kicked out of bounds. It's gonna be a, it's gonna be a throw in. Here comes Filler with a with an amazing throw in again. We'll see how far he can throw it this time. And the Shriner is going to be Looks like subbed out for, out for D. Lou. One of our goal scorers. Yep. Da Daniel Lou. He's a 18. junior, has been amazing this year. Cleared by Medford. Medford clears it. On the offensive. Good defensive and a effort great by Lawrence. Stop by Lawrence. Filler picking up the ball. Gives Give it, it to, to Daniel D. Lou. Lou. Freshly Fresh on legs. the field. Wow, we are just on the same page. Falls a bit, pushed a bit. A bit getting, scrappy getting over physical. there. Getting physical. steals it. Do you lose a smaller man? Gets pushed be, around a little bit. It's going to be Medford ball. It's but a little call there by Steve, heart. but that's all right. You know, Steve can't have them all. And the time has officially stopped. Yep. Five minutes. Up to the refs to call this game. Yep. Looking like a real, looking like a, like a win for Belmont now. Belmont's just looking to hold strong on their defensive yep. side of the field. Waiting Belmont for a few minutes a longer until it's here, locked looking in. Him play smart, play composed, yep. like they have the whole game. Yep. Niko Stefanovic controlling the ball, and he is going to lose it. But Duda steps up and has a good hit. Ball stopped again. Serve tries to clear it out. Gets into five, jumbles the ball a bit, but that's all right. Good pressure by Belmont. And they're feeling, they're feeling the, they're feeling the the gas here, but they continue to push on. Sachel's yelling at his teammates to push up with him, and that'll be out of bounds. It's gonna be out of bounds. Belmont it's gonna be a goal, goal kick. kick. Belmont. I'm feeling like. Uh, Thomas is going to kick this one out. Oh, no, corner kick, actually. Interesting. Oh, that's, I didn't even see that, but. Yep. Looks like we're, looking at, we're looking at what may be the last attempt on goal for yep. Medford. Good corner. Thomas punches it out. Great play by Thomas. And that'll be game? Oh, no, we got a man down. Looks like he'll be all right. Maybe a free kick it's, for, uh, for Medford here. It's Servitopoulos who got hit in the gut, it looks like. And this is going to be, oh, what is it, a, a free kick? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's a free, did yeah, you I see what so. happened? No, but I just, I think it's a free It's going to be a free kick, pretty, free uh, kick. pretty close to the, to the goal. This is dangerous for Belmont. Um, this is definitely their last chance at a goal. Thomas is looking for a big save here if it gets yep. by. Thomas, outstanding goalkeeper. Um, Medford hope, looking to, to put, put this it one away. over and under and on that And here we here. go. And, and it's way over. It. There we go. It. That looks like it's, it's going to be, be subbing Angela Shiner in for... In for d -Lu maybe? In for d -Lu. Probably. Yep, yep, there he goes. Yep, there it is. There I it wonder is. why they did that. Keep d -Lu healthy for the next game, perhaps. Game's about to be over anyways, though. And I think if Thomas boots this, it'll be the end of the game. Look at that, a big boot here from Thomas. It is. 
Goes far, lanes right. And Sam cuts him in, controls it, kicks it out. Get that out by Lawrence. Yeah. Patrick looking to get the ball. Patrick. Deflects it a bit. Nikola playing defense. That's out. Looks out of bounds. It come is. on, come on, Steve, call it. Looking for Steve to call the game here. Come on, Steve. He's, he's looking at he's the time. He's checking his watch. He's checking the watch, checking the watch, put the whistle here, on his here mouth. Here he goes, here he goes. Nope. Just pause the game, just pause the game. Looks like Phil was trying to delay time a little bit. Big throw in. Yeah. And he's whoa, real. Whoa. Hey, 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 hey. That's a yellow if I've ever seen it's one. It's going to be yep. a yellow card. Yup, yup, yup. It doesn't even matter, though, because their season's the going to be over. game's over. That was useless. That was useless. Now they're just now they're just desperate looking for something. Resorting to dirty plays as. Bowden Harris comes in for Patrick yep, Tang, number seven. We love seven. Bowden. Played a great game. Bowden, great guy. Great player. Can we just call it, please? Like, yeah, no, actually, doing? bro. Steve, you know, it's over. Steven. You think Steve's full name is Steven? I don't know. Or do you think it's actually Steve? Because he did say Katie before that. I don't know. I just hope Steve or Steven calls this game soon because. For a big run up from Owen Filler here. Here he goes. Looking to boot it, and he does. <coughs> All these whistles, I keep getting pump fake, thinking it's a, the end of the game. I think after this throw, and hopefully it's going to be the end of this match. Hopefully. And then into round the one. The boys are just are Round just one itching. of the They're just MIAA D1. Wow, sorry. D1 yep, varsity soccer playoffs. Varsity men's soccer. And the boys are just itching to celebrate. More subs, more subs. I don't know what they think this is going to accomplish. Looks like number eight is coming off here. Yeah. He was the one giving Owen Filler some, some talk. Some trouble. Yep. I'm going to call it. I'm going to say. You ready? Three, two, two one. one. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Nope, nope, nope. Is the whistle even in his mouth? No, no I don't think it is. Ready? Three, two, one. Nope. Oof, that was a good shot, though. That was a good that shot. He did, he did bring his hand up. He did bring his hand. Up. All right, come on. This is the, ready, three, two. No, no. Right. I think they're going to throw the ball in. they got to throw the ball in. <laughs> what are they so – oh, I think what they're doing – is subbing this guy on for offense and the other guy on for defense because they probably specialize in that. Looking for two play. goals here. As you see, Mezd Abu Tayyud. Yes. Number nine, Mezd coming Abutayoun, in for the Shriner. Nine, coming in for the Shriner. We love Mezd. Great guy. Last few minutes, but he's got to put in a real big effort here if he wants, yep. to, wants to make his mark on today's game. Yep, yep, yep. And Bama will come up with it. Bowden running for it, and it'll be out of bounds again. And that's going to that be the game. Is the game. That's gonna be the game. That is the Two game. That is the game. 2-0 Belmont on today's win versus Medford. And Belmont goes to Mustangs. thank their goalkeeper. Looks like the Marauders best of Mustangs. On to the next one. They move on to round two of the playoffs. Stretch ice and get back to practice. That's what I say. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, you for showing up. Thank you, my fellow commentator.